So, as you guys may know that there is a new Dragon Ball Super movie coming out in the next year or so. And in the latest statement from Akira, Akira Toriyama himself, the man, the man who created Dragon Ball, uh, he stated that there will be an unexpected character to return and they will uh, explore depths that they haven't explored yet, I guess. So I've done a lot of thought recently on who could possibly be that unexpected character that could be returning. Now. I've seen a lot of people say uh, that Cooler will come back uh, because like of the recent arc and everything to do with Frieza and stuff and it would be pretty fitting to see Cooler come back as he is cooler than Frieza. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, um, but there are so many, so many like predictions on who could come back because Toriyama can make the non-canon canon or anything possible. He is the creator of Dragon Ball, so he could surprise us with literally anything, you know, in this upcoming film. And I must say, I am very, like, intrigued and interested where this is going, considering that we have the Mora art completed in the manga and pretty much the granola arc um or should i say the snickers arc has just started so so i mean they could potentially you know go with moro because i would love to see ultra instinct in a movie like and um and the thing is um yeah that i think and not only that, that would mean like bigger production and better like animation and movie time, but it will be quite hard to fit all of those uh, chapters into like one big film, but I could see it potentially happening. I personally would like to see more about the Pride Troopers. I think that would be a pretty interesting take that is lore that hasn't been explored yet and Jiren in my opinion is an unexpected character I mean we did see him in the tournament of power I mean I'm sure more of you would like to know more about um, you know the universe's strongest fighter or the multiverse's strongest fighter you know, and I think that makes the most logical sense. But again, Dragon Ball is unexpected when it comes to like, you know, bringing characters back, making this canon, making that canon. So we can't really jump to a conclusion because we could literally all think of the same character that could come back and Toriyama could literally throw, it, throw us under the bus and give us someone like maybe Tapion for crying out loud or something or maybe like it's so you know it gets you thinking so much that who could possibly return um again let me know what you guys think in the in the comments below uh I'm interested to what you guys have to say so thank you for watching and if you want to see more videos like these where I discuss pretty much everything Dragon Ball or anime related, let me know in the comments. And peace out.